Hi, and here, and welcome back to my reaction channel. And today we're going to be listening to another Chinchilla song. This one is called Fingers. Yesterday I listened to Little Girl Gone, and I'm very excited to listen to this. So uh, here, we might as well get started. Probably saw me let go. Panicked and you said hello. Swallowing the words you say. You know I'm not okay. So there she's going again with that beautiful textures in her voice and it when she goes high right back in here it sounds like a more vulnerable sound than um before really like it i'm gonna listen to that one more time swallowing the words you say panicked and you said hello right swallowing the words you say you know i'm not okay but let me tell her in cold now you're coming back for more You know me, you know I cave But scars will never fade So meet me So that line, you know I'll never cave And the scars will never fade I'm wondering if this is almost like Some sort of abusive or unhealthy relationship uh, And that's why she kind of sounds more vulnerable in, in this song than she did in yesterday's song for yesterday, she was more empowered. Two o'clock, the same as always. Favorite spot. Okay, so that's a very interesting lyric. So. And she's saying, one by one, I will cut your fingers off so you can never pull me down. So it kind of reiterates what I was just saying, that I think it's a some sort of abusive or unhealthy relationship. But um, yeah, that's quite the statement. And sorry about that. That was my cat turning on and off the light as he walked across my desk. So tell me where your gun gone And tell me is the fun gone Whoa. Maybe I should shed a tear Cause this was me last year So meet me late at night When no one hears us I don't I missed that last line. You, and she's in the shape of me. Is that eyedropper blood? I, I can't even tell. It looks like blood to me. Oh, Well, it definitely had a very catchy beat and tune. She sang it very wonderfully. I think this is a song I'd have to listen to again and again to fully understand it. Um, it does seem like this, the song 
and the video seems to display all these different characters and I don't know if it's all the same person I mean obviously it's the same person playing all the characters but if they're meant to be all the same person and different personalities or if this is in fact all these different women having the same issue with the same person um, each of them have portrayed in a way that makes them each seem deranged in their own way um, and additionally um, yeah, it just seems like a completely unhealthy relationship on every facet. However, the song was very catchy. Um, the chorus is definitely something that will be stuck in my head the rest of the night. And I really did enjoy it. I think this is, though, a video I'm going to have to watch again and again because I, I was having a hard time concentrating on each character's kind of storyline um, all the way through, especially when they were all coming up on the screen at the same time. So um, good on them because that means I'm going to have to watch it again and again to totally understand it. But I did enjoy the song a lot. So yay. Anyway, so um, let me know if there's anything else you want me to react to from uh, Chinchilla or Ren or anybody else that you think I might enjoy. And until then, um, I will see you next time. Bye.